The Phantom Creeps was released on January 7th, 1939. Bela Lugosi plays a mad doctor named Dr. Zorka, who uses an arsenal of very strange inventions while a military officer tries to report on the certain death of his wife and himself and tries to stop him in the act of actually killing innocent people with his own crazy inventions. Belagosi plays some pretty good roles here, but the inventions I think are what makes it so crazy. The first one was an invisibility uh, belt. The effects are not as good as the Invisible Man, but they are still a good shot to look at. They're still kind of goofy. The second invention is pretty much a little spider. When it actually goes into contact with a metal disc, it explodes and brings the character into a state of suspended animation. In other words, it just knocks them out. And then the third one is probably the best one. It's a freaking robot. Yeah, a robot with probably the goofiest face ever. And for some reason, it's just so weird. It's, it's, it's unbelievable. And this guy, literally, this doctor, literally has something that beats Frankenstein, sort of. He has a regular laboratory, but he has a secondary secret laboratory with a secret agent that creates his inventions. And if it ever gets found out, it would mess up his, his whole life's work. The Phantom Crease was a film serial, back during the days where, like, TV was film serials. Film serials basically had cliffhangers, and you had to go back to the theater to go check it out. It was a very good one, but it's not really my favorite. I think it's, I've gone through four hours of the entire series, and it's not a good series to watch, especially on this low quality. The robot's silly, but for many people, I think it's worth watching. But tomorrow, oh boy, tomorrow, it's definitely not going to be worth watching. Because we're going to be looking at a remake of probably one of the best ghost stories I've ever seen. Well, see what good it is. The cops will never let anything like that walk down the street. What could the police or anybody do against an army like them? <laughs>